Today in the Fresh Brew Run vlog. This is my last strength run of the season. But I almost just got run over again. Nice. So I have a package that I am pumped about. One, two, three. Good afternoon, welcome to episode 42 of the Fresh Brew Run vlog. It is crunch time in the marathon training schedule. This is my last strength run of the season. Six one mile repeats with 400 meter rest in between. I cannot be happier to not have to do a strength workout after this. Finally, it's a chilly day. I hope the, the marathon is these conditions. This would be perfect. So anyway, let's just get this over with. Last strength workout of the season. Let's go. All right, here we go. Nice. All right, one down. Quarter mile recovery. Ooh, that felt good. All right, let's go. Number two. All right, lap two done. That was good, a little windy, but I'm all good. Good run so far. All right, cool down done. Lap number three, windy, woo, it's starting to drizzle, oh boy, all right, three down, halfway, woo, feeling great, all right, lap number four, let's go, four down, woo yeah, that was good, that was good, ah, oh, feel great, I want to be like, it's a cool down, it's a cool down, I don't normally run this slow. <laughs> and now it's gonna be awkward because I'm about to kick up the pace and blast by him as if I'm trying to compete with this guy, but I'm not. I'm just doing my own thing. Anyway, lap number five, let's do this. Five down. I hate doing that. I feel like such a jerk. Like I'm trying to like toy with that guy. I feel bad. I'm just doing a workout. It's nothing personal. Probably reading way too much into that. But anyway, ominous clouds ahead but almost done. I'm gonna catch my breath, get back after it. All right, let's go, last one. All right, six down. Just a quarter mile recovery, cool down, and then I am done with strength workouts, finally. Although that was the most fun I think I have ever had on a strength workout. I love the mile repeat distance, really, really fun. So, whew, feeling good. All right, well, I'm gonna wrap this one up. That was a great run. Just feeling good right now. So anyway, tomorrow I have an off day. So I will see you next on Wednesday for my last tempo run. Hello, hello, happy Tuesday. I'm not running today, it's my off day, but I do have something that I'm going to do right now that I'm very excited about. The entry for the Chicago Marathon is now open. So I am going to apply and see what happens. So you can apply from now until November 16th, and then they let you know if you made it in on December 7th, 2023. So, so many people apply to the Chicago Marathon that they can only let a certain number in. I applied last year, I did not get it, which is why I'm running in Indy this year, but hopefully things will work out for me this year, so I'm going to apply, and I'll see you on December 7th to let you know what happened. Nice. All right, good morning, happy Wednesday. It's a great day for a run. It's a great day for the last hard workout of my marathon training block. Today I have a 10 mile tempo run and after that it's all easy runs and tapering from there. So very excited. I am ready to get the difficult workouts out of the way and start to taper. So yeah, I'm gonna get this uh, popping. Great day, it's, it's nice high 40s this would be perfect conditions for the marathon so excited all right ready set go go <laughs> false alarm false start oh look at this beautiful here's that fall foliage we were looking for cool all right, one loop of three loops done. I feel okay, I'm a little congested today. 
I hope it's just allergies, but well, stuffed up. Otherwise, not bad. Audi activities. Halfway. Chocolate outrage time. Nice. All right, two loops done. Half a loop to go. Ish. Sort of. Maybe. I don't know. Running math. Impossible. A little finish line. <laughs> That's how you get killed. My goodness. Closing out my last tempo run with one of the worst stop sign runs of the year. I saw that coming. I just got so worked up I went the wrong way. <laughs> this is gonna be a little bit longer than a 10 mile tempo run. That's okay. That's fine. Man. All right. All right. Tempo run, done. It is officially taper time. My favorite part of marathon training. Whew, what a run, that was great. That felt good. Had to adjust the course a little bit, ran about a quarter mile too far, but that's okay. Just a quarter mile. Whew. Finished strong, I feel good, despite a little stuffiness. Hopefully that clears up in the next week and a half, but man, I made it, I made it through all the tough workouts so whew. so i'm gonna finish this run up with a little cool down but otherwise i have an easy run tomorrow it's all easy runs until the marathon from here on out so i will see you then good morning happy thursday it is a great day for a run a little pre-dawn run seven mile recovery run today so just kind of taking it chill again i will stop talking until the sun comes up so you're not staring at a headlamp but feeling good today all right a little lighter out sun is still not up but yeah, i feel tired today i mean i ran hard yesterday but that cumulative fatigue like i said seven mile run i'm just trying to tack on an extra half mile at the end of my six mile route so i'm just gonna kind of circle around here here's the farmer's market see what's going on not much anyway so i did not have my camera up but i almost just got run over again and this time i have a headlamp on and my reflective vest and guess what it didn't matter and why do i bring that up well there was a recent tweet from the michigan department of highway safety which is basically like the michigan organization in charge of road safety that said it was a pedestrian tip i'll put it on the screen but basically pedestrians should wear bright clothing when they're out walking which to me here i am wearing bright clothing and i have back-to-back -back days where someone completely blew a stop sign the idea that the onus of safety should be on the pedestrians and what they wear instead of the people driving 3,000 to 9,000 pound vehicles says exactly what we think about pedestrians in the region in order to not get hit wear a bright shirt that's how dangerous our sidewalks are you know i'm in royal oak right now there's a whole campaign to stop any and all road diets keep our streets wide and safe they say which is just ludicrous but anyway that kind of ticked me off a little bit and here i am in a high viz with a headlamp and guess what michigan department of highway safety and whatever doesn't matter people drive like reckless idiots and i just have to predict that or else i get run over by a jeep compass anyway halfway through the run feeling good sun is coming up just a great little day for a run Whew. no turn signal stop sign whatever check that out cool sunrise or mordor I mean, look at that. Wonderful. Nice. All right, well, I'm gonna wrap this one up. Good run. Beautiful weather outside. Perfect weather for a recovery run. So, uh, yeah, that'll be it for today. Tomorrow, I think I have an eight mile easy run. So, I will see you then. Nice. Nice. 
Good morning, happy Friday. Made it through another week. It is a great day for a run. A little rainy, a little drizzle out, but I dare say the sun might be peeking out in a second. So good news there. Nice. Please don't hit me, please don't hit me. Have an eight mile easy pace run today. So just shuffling through it. Check this out, see that sign in the middle of the road that's bent over? That is a uh, stop for pedestrians within crosswalk sign. Another one that got run over and now needs to be replaced because people not only ignore pedestrians, they ignore the actual sign that tells them to stop for pedestrians. Nice. Halfway. This is pretty uneventful. I'm pretty tired. Just kind of want this gloomy run to be over with. The sun did not come out. That's okay. Cool tree. See, I can't see the other side. Nice. All right, I'm gonna wrap this one up. Good run today. Uh, yeah, just taking it easy. So nothing out of the ordinary. A little tired, but I'm good. So anyway, tomorrow, another eight mile easy run. So I will see you then. All right, people, very excited about this. Let me just set you down in the old studio. So I have a package that I am pumped about. So I just bought a new pair of running shoes. So I'm going to open these up on the vlog. It's Thursday still, by the way. No, it's not. It's Friday. Anyway, yikes. Glad it's not Thursday. But I got some new shoes. Oh, I got the New Balance Fresh Foam X 1080 V13. So this is New Balance's like everyday kind of trainer. I do have the, the More V4. The reason I got these is because of these. I have loved running in the More V4. Um, this foam and the cushioning is awesome. This is the same type of foam, but just like a little lighter, more of an everyday type of shoe. So very excited about this. Honestly, I don't know when I'm going to do a review of this. I would love to post this right away, but I also don't want to make like six videos in a row. I don't even have time to do that. So anyway, um, I have no idea when I'm going to post this review, but I will try to run in these relatively soon. Right off the bat, they're pretty light, which is kind of cool. So we'll see. Um, we'll see what, what these shoes are all about. That'll be, uh, that'll, will be it for Friday. I will see you tomorrow um, for something I'm very excited about. So adios. Good morning, happy Saturday. It's a great day for a run. I am downtown Detroit on a very exciting run. Uh, the video should be live now, but I'm going to the grand opening of a new section of the East River Walk. Check that out. That is the chestnut. I don't know what it's carrying, but appears to be docked in the Detroit River or moored, anchored, I don't know. So I am running from the Cullen Plaza to this new section of the riverfront. Again, I'm making a full video about that for like the ribbon cutting. Um, and I'm hoping to run on it. We'll see if I'm able to. So eight mile easy pace. I don't know, this is gonna be a real easy meandering run um, along the river rock, which is my favorite place to run. And they're making it even better. So check that video out, it should be live on my channel. Um, otherwise, I don't know how much I'm gonna check in for today's run for the vlog. Uh, because the other video kind of is a vlog. So anyway, here we go. And with the ribbon cutting today, it's an historic day because now the Detroit Riverfront truly belongs to the people of this city. Thank you for everybody that made it possible. One, two, three. That was very cool. Great to hear the, the history and all the speeches. So again, check that video out. It's on my channel now. But yeah, really happy I came down here for this today. Awesome. All right, just on my way back. What a great run. This is so much fun. Everybody's so happy today. What a good day. Check it out, I picked up a 
a finger foam finger. <laughs> I'll put this in the background of my uh, little studio setup. I'll also put a link in the description of this video to the Riverfront Conservancy if you're interested in learning a little bit more. All right, well, I'm gonna wrap today's vlog, today's video up. Great run, honestly, such a fun day. Had a blast running one week until the marathon, one week from today, so very excited. So with that, I'll see you tomorrow for an easy run. Nice. Good evening, happy Sunday. It's a great day for a run. <laughs> A little bit of a late start, but uh, yeah, just getting in an easy six mile run. Feeling a little tired, but otherwise, nice night. Nice. Nice. We got a train. Nice. Cool, that's a good one. That's a long train, nice. Always good to see a train when you're out on a run. All right, so I'm gonna wrap this run up and this entire video up. Great week, action-packed week. Um, had a lot of fun running, you know, last, last hard week before the marathon and then it's taper time. So I'm gonna post this video. It's gonna be posted a little bit early and then I'm gonna do a shorter weekly vlog that I'm going to post early again and then I'm going to cover my entire marathon weekend in a standalone vlog so got some stuff coming up so stay tuned for that but yeah that'll be it for today thank you for watching subscribe if you haven't already I'll see you soon